One way or another, <laughs> the clocks are springing ahead everywhere this weekend. What are you, a werewolf? <laughs> All right, but Maybe. for the woman who was called America's Singing Sweetheart in the 1940s and 50s, this day is bringing up quite a memory. Landmark Eastern Columbia building on L.A. South Broadway today, but in 1950 and for daylight saving time, I get no kick from one of MGM's biggest stars, Monica Lewis, seemingly pushing those heavy hands to where they needed to be. I would try anything. I wasn't afraid and uh, nothing fazed me. At 90 years old, Monica Lewis is doing great, and looking back on that day, she said she held on tight 13 stories up. Her Hollywood life storied as well. Ed Sullivan's very first guest, the relationship with Ronald Reagan and years of ignoring close proximity to enemy lines entertaining the troops. Fast forward 1974 and the movie Earthquake. Lewis won praise for doing her own stunt work, and now this long forgotten MGM publicity photo showing up and on the appropriate day. Who climbs a ladder and fixes a clock anyway in life? And a little more backstory on this moment captured. Monica said it was kind of twofold. The MGM publicity department liked her and she had a hard time saying no. She kind of enjoyed the work. And if you look real close, you see Lewis holding what appears to be something to get those hands in the right place. But over 60 years later, there's a little more to what the old studio system wanted us to believe. I don't know how much I could have turned that big thing. That's awful big. Wow. A little bit of that Hollywood magic. Yeah. <laughs> Smoke and mirrors from Hollywood's golden age. Dave Meekham, KTLA 5 News. I and love Dave it. also she told me that twinkle in her eye. she was the voice of Chiquita Bananas. Remember that? How does that go again, Rick? I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> But she was the voice. Jim will sing it for <laughs> yeah, us. Jim will sing everything. I'm a Chiquita.